push can't last touch. The game here will dead them again. So we're gonna get this anyway. Yep. Or else we get uh, two bizarre or a bizarre thing each. Yeah, like a total of five dollars. And, and we're gonna just see like we're gonna do a reaction on it later to see what they taste like with all of the stuff. But I think I might no, I don't know what this is. Right here, and I might wanna try that. It's my bizarre thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Those are all fish. Hold up, can you just eat that? I, I, I'm pretty sure you can. I, I'm not one good reaction video on that. I'm just very, I'm very confused. Yeah, that's ten bucks. Yeah, but what would you do with this? Eat it. It's would you, food. I, I think you would, maybe you would put this with a soup. Yeah. Well, oh, those are tiny little ones. Look at all the little itty bitty ones. Like no, I'm not. I think that's more for like soup. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. What are those? Puff cereal. They're biscuits. They're just like munchy. Two bucks. Two bucks. Two ninety nine. Mm -hmm. The main places that we're gonna be choosing from are about shredded. Quit, Death. No. I'll try that. Not me. I'm not keen. We're gonna go down the candy aisle. Look at all this candy. Mm. So I'm trying to figure out what to get. I'm thinking. Not these. Oh, they're expensive. No. No. Those are delicious. Fish things. But these ones are just ice, or the cold ones. Huh. So these are, um. Yeah, quick fast. Mom, look. Yeah, they're like this. It's the pastry with the chocolate yeah. ice cream, but these ones are the frozen ones. That's cool. What if that looks weird, guys? Oh, snow ice. That's good. Alright. Who's this? I don't yeah. know what that is. Well, let's just pick something down the candy aisle. Okay, we'll be back. We got a bunch of stuff. Lots of stuff in there. So, he's gonna show what we got. I'm gonna start off with these things. Not for too fancy. Everyone loves these. They're the little chocolate sticks. It's basically like a little shortbread stick with chocolate in it. I think it's shortbread, technically. Um, but they're good. They're really good. Actually, perfect milk straws when you keep them cold. You should try that later. Yeah, I'll definitely. But um, the different. I've never. I haven't had Japanese ones. Um, I always get the normal kind from the store. I've never gotten them from a jet for uh, the Japanese versions, which are actually really good. And this was only five bucks for all of them, which is a. It's a steal. The price tag isn't on there anymore, but look at all of that. That's a steal. Especially considering how good they are, and they're so rich that you could not eat too many of them. You'll get sick. So, they'll last. Um, next thing we got, we're gonna start simple. We got some drinks. We each got one drink, and he got the... I'm gonna put that down. He got the peach. I got the uh, grape. I've had both of these, but he hasn't had the peach, so this is more of a reaction for him to taste this, but I want to show you how to open these. It's actually really fun to open. Yeah, so once he peels that off, we're gonna take to another clip of how we explode them, because they go kaboom. If you don't open them right, <laughs> they do. <laughs> That's my doggo up there. Should we let him in? Uh, yeah, we should go a little bit back. Alright, so we kind of went a little bit of ahead. 
uh, but basically you get you get this and what you do is you push that out to get this this little striking thing right here so you see how this is this has like a ball right there you put this on the ball and then you firmly slam it down we're gonna we're gonna show you a clip Three, you don't actually slam it down. Uh, if you do it that way, what will happen is it will bubble up and come out at the top, and you can lose half the soda that way. So what you're just gonna do is you're gonna put it on the palm of your hand so that it doesn't pinch your skin, and just press. That actually wasn't that bad, but it is sticky. But then at that point, you just taste it. All right, neat little thing. The bowl is now in the soda. I, I don't know if you can see that in there. But I think it's actually pretty neat that they set it up that way. And so they, what they did was they set it up as like a little hammock, but the uh, slots down there where it's hold, uh, holding it actually have, are open. It's just tight enough so the ball can go through. So I'm gonna film Ethan while he does his. Hello there. Right. Here we go. Is actually pretty hard. Yeah, it's pretty tough. Oh, I hurt a little bit. There you go. Nothing out. Cool. There's that little ball, marble. All right, taste it. Tell me what you think of it. Yeah, actually, tastes like real peach. Yeah, peach is pretty good. All right. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. really taste artificially. Yeah, like same most. Same with the grape. They both agree that the grape is the better out of all of them so far that we've tried. But um, we feel, I uh, personally think that it tastes more like a muscadine grape. We actually had a bush down there, and it tastes just like the grape we used to grow down there. But it's so good. And they're small, so it's not like you're... You don't feel like you're drinking a big soda, and it's just the right amount of sweetness. But... Next, we got this, we got this, I got another thing with me. I got two things for like a dollar. I just thought it was so bizarre looking. I didn't know what it was. And then I, I read it. It says fettuccine up there, but it's, it's like gummy. So we're going to open this up real quick and try this. I don't, I don't know if it's like gum or if it's like a actual gummy. I don't even, I think it might be sour. I'm not even sure what this is. I've never even seen it. Maybe like really sweet, it might be just sugar. It might, yeah, it might be sweet. Oh, it smells like bubble. It smells like, um. Oh, it smells like, uh, Jolly Rancher grape. Or it, uh, or another way to describe it, you know the, um, grape Big big Lee Chew? Yeah. Or if you've ever had Big Lee Chew, the grape uh, flavor, that's another way to smell, or think of the smell. Let's feel it. Oh, it's like a gummy. It is an actual gummy. Oh. That's yeah, it's sour good. or sweet. I like that. It's not bad. It's mainly sweet, but just a bit sour. Yeah, it's actually perfect. <laughs> it's so small. That's what it looks like in the package. I'm gonna shut it up to where you can um, you can close it, and you can like keep it with you. That's kind of nice. Do you want to do your thing next? Okay. Yeah. All right, this is um, Ethan's thing before we go on to the really bizarre so thing. So, we don't... I thought, wow, that, that texture looks really weird, though. And yeah, we don't know what this is. We can't I, tell I'm if it's a piece of chocolate it's, or a I'm brownie. I'm pretty sure it's just chocolate. Or, yeah, chocolate brownie, and then it looks like it has, like, a strawberry gel inside. There was another version of this. It was a green tea version. But, but that didn't look that good. We didn't... It looked kind of weird. Oh, oh, look at that. That's nifty. Whoa. Oh wow, look at that. The individually wrapped. That's not that's not brownie. That's hard. Oh yeah. What is this? It's a weird texture to put it that in. It makes it look like it's a cake like No, it's a chocolate. No, this is straight up chocolate. Hey, can you open mine for me as well? Yeah, but look yeah. at that. It's like a little chocolate cube you can open. Yeah. Oh wow. That's really easy true. Is it sweet? Yeah, it's sweet. Wait, is this, this might be something like you put in your coffee, maybe. I don't know. I quite like these. It's not bad. It's actually... 
It's like smooth chocolate. That's actually really good. If you ever see these, I suggest them. Oh, look at that. One thing that's nice is that it doesn't hurt your throat when you eat them. Oh, that's cute. They have like a little message in it in Japanese. I, I can't read that, but... If you're, if you can read this, please comment down what it says. Yeah, if you can read that, please say something. I want to know what that says. It's cute that they do that. This is just weird and bizarre. They're chips, but... I think it's... I don't know if it's like spicy. You can see here... Oh no, it's spicy shrimp. flavored shrimp chips. Let's see that. That's, that's... I don't even know. Smell that. Oh, it smells like dog food. Yeah, it smells like dog food. Mm. Uh, no. Mm -mm. Uh. I, I want it. After taste, it gets weird. Well, we need soda. Oh god. Oh, then I feel the spice. It's not even spicy in my... That's disgusting. That's nasty. No. Get out of here. Hey, the bring these with Yeetus deletus. No more shrimp piss. That's disgusting. That's just bad. I don't... Give me gummy. I need gummy. I know. It's so gross. I don't like that. It's dog food. It literally smells like dog food and tastes like. <laughs> That's so good. It tastes so bad. Not this. No, no, that. I can't explain the taste of it. Like, it smells like straight up dog food. No. Bad. That is bad. Do you want to even go get my, my bag, Charlie? Sure, we're probably not going to get that. Let's try and get on foot. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's weird. Yeah, I think we might end it now. That's our review. I do suggest 100%. We suggest these and these. And definitely get these. Just, just, just get, get everything except for that. Yeah, just get these things. That just, little piece of garbage. Are the best, best sodas ever. Please, we really do. The flavors that we really suggest are original, peach, and grape. Because we think those are the best. Also, lychee is really good. Orange is good. Orange is also good. But I think the best ones that we like, the ones that we like the most are Grape and Original. And he's a Fanta dude. He loves Fanta. He rates this over Fanta. That's how good this flavor is. Yeah. So, please I, try actually, that. I sort of like the orange one a little bit more, though. Well, that's I mean, like, this is a very cool soda. Yeah, this is a very, very good soda. If you ever see a bubblegum flavor, I think they stopped making them, but if you ever see bubblegum flavor, don't grab it. It tastes like straight up cough syrup. So don't get the bubblegum flavor of the um, Ramona sodas. But these are incredible. I'm gonna get another one. Want one? Uh, okay. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, like, comment, visit his channel. Link in the description. I make music. Nice. And thank you guys for watching. Goodbye.